Hey, what's going on, YouTube? It's Nick from Noob Kill coming at you with another Madden video today. So, guys, of course, we got this new message of the day right here. It is 2021, guys. So, happy New Year's to you guys. Hopefully, 2021 is an amazing year for us and it treats us a lot better than 2020 had um, in the past. But, of course, guys, I'm excited. Postseason is right around the corner. We're about to get it's week 17. We're about to get into wild cards and all that stuff. So, I'm hoping um, all your, your favorite team made it into the postseason. And, of course, we are in the hunt for the Super Bowl. So, a lot of amazing content will be coming out in the game for sure so stay glued to the channel and all that stuff but we got a very nice message of the day right here um one of the main points that they did mention is that they will be extending the new year's program to of course the fourth so that is until tomorrow guys so if you guys have any loose ends that you need to finish off make sure you guys go ahead and finish off we're actually gonna go ahead and finish off some loose ends um in this video as well but the very very big part of course about this is that the new year's program is gonna be ending on the fourth so i don't know if that means the field pass is ending too and then we're gonna get our tournament and all that stuff guys if we do get a tournament guys i will be streaming that live on twitch um so go ahead and check out the link in the description go ahead and give it a follow and of course turn on notifications so you know when we go live and of course guys if you want to help out the channel your guys' support has been amazing always um but if you want if you haven't already subscribed go ahead and hit that subscribe button and of course go ahead and smash that like button as well but the big thing right here it says we hope you join us on of course the fifth to begin something ultimate guys so that's actually really really insane guys i have no idea what that means obviously we're in ultimate team and everything but usually when we use the word ultimate it is worked with ultimate legends and usually ultimate legends i believe don't come out until like the end of the season like after the super bowl so if we are going to get ultimate legends that's going to be pretty insane you guys give me your best guess of what you think ultimate is what is it going to be if nick goes ahead and gives us some information or anything like that i will get you guys a video and all that stuff but like I said, in today's video, we are going to be completing off some loose ends. Now, actually, I think, I think I haven't spent any mana cash inside of this program. I did spend gems. I spent about probably like four or 5,000 gems. I did get lucky because I know I started into the program with less than, uh, I think I had less than 10,000 and, and not for, for New Year's program, but I think because before New Year's, I was trying to finish off, um, like the arctic players are trying to get to the 50,000 points so i did buy like the sideline pass so that brought me above the 10,000 and i've been chilling at 10,000 i honestly thought i was going to spend money um on ultimate freeze but ended up not spending money there and then for the new year's content i was like okay let's see how far i can build and if on the last day if i need to build anything or i need to buy anything i'll go and spend and actually i didn't i got super lucky guys um and i actually did pull um some players so you guys want to make sure you play these even if you finish off the sets i will play these later um but make sure you guys play these because because you have a chance at a 91 overall new year's player inside of here um and of course those new year's players are going to be used inside of sets and everything like that so we are going to be completing the new year's player right here now we are missing one player um and that is of course williams right there i did pull everson griffin right there i did pull him out of the live event and i think i pulled one other player that i did sell or he's on the team now if you guys go to my team right now guys i really desperately need a running back i just really need a running back we are running with my favorite bo jackson but he's only an 89 overall and we're still rocking that jim brown we got for free um oops not mike vick we are still running with uh jim brown that we got for free from of course the halloween day where he played that live event you know what i'm saying guys so we desperately need a running back and i thought like yo this could have been a place where we got a running back because if you guys know if we go back to the new year's content um if we go to over here and we go to rewards inside season one so if that was the journey with like bo jackson's uh season pass there is only one running back inside of this whole program i believe and that is of course ezekiel elliott at 95 overall he does have some really great stats as well 93 speed and everything like that um but i kind of like thought about that a little too deep and we already did pull everson griffin so i was just like I'm not I'm just gonna go ahead and complete this now the four players that we can go ahead and get is either Kyler Murray who does have 91 speed and everything like that. we could get Terry as well Bradley Chubb or Jair Alexander now I might go for Bradley Chubb he does have some pretty good stats 96 am um, 94 pursuit 94 block shed and 86 speed that's not too bad and everything like that now the reason why I went for these guys is because they do have better power guys and I know power is something that like we all don't like but you do have to have a good power team um in competitive modes like that is a really really deal breaker um I feel like the overall is actually less compared to power guys and why I say that is because obviously we 
if you do have a higher power than your opponent you do get those plus overall bonuses and if you have a lot more power than your opponent he could be a 90 overall team or 95 overall team and you could be like a 93 overall team but you have like a lot more power you get that plus five so now your team is now a 98 overall you know what i'm saying kind of like it's not like every stack gets plus one over overall but it's like kind of like that it's kind of like that if you guys kind of get what i'm saying so power is very very useful so that's why i'm gonna go for him um so what are we gonna do guys so in today's video we are gonna complete a set so if we go to sets um, I already do have this set all complete out and this is gonna be a selectable player So I basically just need my man Williams right there um, So yeah, what we did get I got all the players from playing live events from the Christmas presents and all that stuff doing the ball drop and everything um, And all the party hats. So this is gonna be a selected a bull player So let's go ahead and open up this bad boy and it's gonna save me some coins from buying him off the auction house um, Which was another option I was gonna do but there's Everson Gris Griffin and there is our man Williams right there I believe uh make sure there's no other williams yep okay so there we go so we're gonna go ahead and claim him um and then of course looking at my team so we could go for a quarterback we could go for a cornerback <laughs> um a linebacker and i forget the other a wide receiver so wide receivers we're pretty good we're pretty good on wide receivers we got marvin harrison dk metcalf and uh, randy moss um, and then of course for our linebackers, I feel like that would be probably the most significant help there. Um, who is over here that I could put in? Um, Charles Woodson. Okay. No, um, let's, let's do it like this. Let's, let's keep it like that. So we could get a diamond, um, a cornerback and get a uh, Hopkins out, but Hopkins is actually pretty baller. I'm not going to lie. He's pretty baller. Um, and right now we're rocking with Chandler Jones, Rob Gronkowski, and of course, Derek Thomas. So I think the linebacker position would probably be the most help right here. Um, so I think we're gonna go for Bradley Chubb. So let's go ahead and do that today, guys. Let's go ahead and finish off that set. So if we go here, we go to uh, New Year's Eve, and then we put in our man, and then now we get to go ahead and select. So there we go, we get a big upgrade right here. We're also gonna get a reward pack, and that is gonna be some pristine ice, I believe. So there is our pristine ice, and we are actually gonna use that as well, because we're gonna finish off another master right here. But there we go, here are our players. And like I said, we are gonna go ahead and pick up Bradley Chubb, even though, Alexander actually I don't know man Alexander has some insane stats as well 93 speed with 93 man coverage you know what I'm gonna go ahead and pick up I'm gonna go ahead and pick up oh my goodness I don't even know man I feel like the speed is not even that crazy but I'm gonna go for Alexander actually we're gonna go for Alexander he has some great stats that is pretty baller so we're gonna finish off him I know I just did a change up but the other thing we are gonna go ahead and do and talk about is our grand master so we already finished off Marvin Harrison guys right we get all the way up to a 95 there is this like pristine ice trade in and everything and then of course there's Deacon Jones as well and then of course they got the new Larry Allen when New Year's content came out now we just need to go ahead and put in one pristine ice there and now we are finished all of of course larry allen so let's go ahead and do that so let's claim the first one we are gonna get an 89 overall larry allen card so it's gonna help out our offensive line so that's absolutely awesome um and then we keep it rolling moving upwards inside of here keep it rolling 91 overall and of course these guys are nice because they are wild card and everything like that and these guys are technically free to do um and everything like you could technically get 100 for free either it'd be larry allen marvin jones or deacon jones or larry allen deacon jones or marvin harrison um i i pretty much did all this not really spending too much i didn't really spend anything too much during the fuel pass um but there we go guys we finished off 95 overall larry allen now if you guys were wondering how to get the 97 overalls it is this set right here you have to go ahead and complete all 95 overalls now i had a kind of feeling it was going to be something like this kind of something like we saw from of course most feared where you had to get like all of the players plus of course i forget what it was called was it like plasma or something where you have to put in for um uh michael vick Derek thomas and of course i forget the other uh brian dawkins those three you have to get all of them to like you have to get all three of the masters after that you have to go ahead and get um all the ectoplasm or whatever it was i, I don't think it was ectoplasm but it was a special um 
a collectible just like this one right here now it gets really expensive because a lot of people thought okay maybe if i finish off marvin harrison i could get 97 overall marvin harrison right kind of like this obviously if you do do this set you get all three of them at 97 overall which is pretty big because you get a plus two overall bonus and then on top of that you also get a plus 40 power bonus as well with these four players but with them kind of hiding this set and not really talking about it you have to like follow the live streams or be in the discords to go ahead and follow this information if you were just playing this game without following nothing like hey i was just what i was just um playing the game and then boom um you you had no idea this set was going to come out that would be kind of that kind of that's kind of where it's like man i wish there was a little more talk about it like in game like actual in game there was like a push notification like hey guys you're going to need all this stuff at the end or have this set locked but you can see what items are going to be in it like obviously we're going to see that you need three players at 95 overall so just have marvin harrison have this set kind of have two question marks kind of like with of course a deacon jones and larry allen so it doesn't give away who the other masters are um but then of course the most expensive kicker part was the pristine ice so you after finishing off all three of the masters which i believe is going to cost you 18 pristine ice to do all three of the masters so like it's uh nine pristine ice i believe or no it is six pristine ice per master and then we times that by three so that's 18 and then if you want to upgrade them to a 97 overall if i did my math correctly that's a total of 28 pristine ice now granted they were giving out pristine ice very very readily inside of course christmas presents they were uh, like the masterful presents company any master for doing the achievements in the game yes there was a lot more ways to get pristine ice but a a lot of people really did not want deacon jones on their team it wasn't like a crazy card so people were looking at that set and really trading their the collectibles in for pristine ice so they can finish off other sets but once you do that you're basically negated you it's impossible for you once you trade in once you do this ice exchange set once it was impossible for you to do the master set like the 97 upgrade set that's what kind of sucked i wish there was like a little heads up before because i know there's a lot of people that did this set i was about to do this myself too um obviously now i can't even finish off deacon jones because i have no more pristine ice and i'm not going to go for the 97s because i definitely don't have another 10 um on top of the the six i need for of course getting him to 95 overall but that's kind of just the rant right there i wish there was just like more clarity inside of these sets um for of course the 97 overall i get it it's going to be very expensive to go ahead and complete this set it's not going to be obtainable free to play i understand that but it's just like even if people spent like if they did this ice exchange set once it's a wrap it's a wrap so i really didn't like that part about um the the grand masters for this arctic expedition everything but like that but it was nice that we did get to be complete players for free get 95 overalls i'm not going to complain there it's just that i wish there was just a little bit more clarity inside of the program um from the beginning not just at the end hey guys boom here's a set you're gonna need x amount of stuff to go ahead and put that in so let's go ahead and put these guys in um and we're moving up on on our team it's looking a little better here and there so that is pretty awesome guys so yeah guys that is gonna end off today's video we got an update team here who is this oh so i did pull jordan reed too okay we'll put him in i might sell him i don't know we might sell that so i pulled i pulled two guys i think maybe even three no two guys two guys for sure um from the live events jordan reed and or no i pulled i pulled that from the one of the i don't even know where i got that one from maybe that was from the ball drop but yeah guys that's what we kind of got that's going to end off the video a little bit of rant at the end i apologize for that um but that is what it is there we go guys so thank you guys so much for watching like i said we will be having something ultimate on the fifth so stay tuned for that guys of course if you guys did enjoy this video go ahead and hit that subscribe button leave a like on this video and of course as always stay hype and i'll catch you guys soon peace What's up? Yeah.